So the parade uh, kicks off Fire Prevention Week and what it gives us the ability to do is to interact with the community. Uh, we brought together a good representation of Dane County Fire Departments uh, to, the, uh, to the parade. So it allows us to impact a greater portion of the Dane County population. Uh, it, downtown Madison makes a lot of sense because of the fact that there's plenty of things to do independent of the parade itself. And downtown Madison got involved with a number of different uh, uh, events that surrounded uh, fire prevention and fire safety. We uh, really made a push this year uh, between the City of Madison Fire Department, Dane County uh, Fire Chiefs. We, uh, we made a push to, to have more involvement and more representation. Uh, it, it also was uh, beneficial to have somebody like downtown Madison step up to, uh, to promote this in advance of the event. But we've had, I think, we have anywhere from 23 to 25 departments and anywhere from 25 to 30 apparatus represented today. Right, so whenever we have uh, an, a, a, an event that we, that we promote, we do it with the idea of involving a number of different age groups. Uh, one is to provide information on the safety and prevention aspect. But another one is to seriously have those that are starting to think about what they want to do uh, in their adulthood start consider the, the professions that are available. And this gives them an opportunity to sit down with some firefighters and ask some questions. Uh, what I would say uh, probably positively impacts um, our outreach is the fact that it's a, it's a significant event that had uh, a good uh, a, there was a good amount of outreach that happened in advance of the, the event itself. So uh, we, uh, we see a lot of people who are, who are approaching us throughout the course of the day, the parade, the static display, to seriously ask questions about the services that are offered within their community, but also, you know, anything from how do I make my, my home safer to what can I do if I want to be a firefighter. And, and those are some really good questions and some, some uh, good, good um, topics to be able to cover in a very short amount of time. What's special about uh, an event like this is we get to take advantage of the networking that exists within the county. Uh, no fire department, especially on the suburban side of things, no fire department can operate independently. We rely on our neighbors. Mutual aid is something that is required in order to address some significant incidents. So to be able to have conversations with those that we will likely work with in advance of the emergency, to take advantage of that networking opportunity is also of extreme value to firefighters that you know really need to have a working relationship with those that they'll be working alongside. Yeah, what I would say is this is a great event. The, the fire truck parade gives us an opportunity to, to uh, have a conversation with the community, but it is not limited to today. At, at any point, if you have a question or a comment, a concern about your fire service, take advantage of the fact that we're very local and we would love to talk to you about the services that we provide and what we do on a day in, day out basis to accomplish that task. So, uh, you know, knock on some doors and, and, uh, and have a conversation with your fire department even beyond Fire Prevention Week.